Digital Marketing Misfits. Long story short, there's this construction site. I guess they're tearing up a road. It's like a road in like a neighborhood. And the one guy starts here and he uh, he basically comes to work one day and one of his cones is, is painted like Patrick Starr. And he's like, I ain't even mad. <laughs> and then the whole chat's like, I can't wait to see the algorithm for when somebody else well, uh, somebody else says I've been painting cones. He comes back the next day, and then he's got sp- he's got the uh, was it SpongeBob was the next one. And then- <laughs> <laughs> so basically, because everybody's a content creator these days, this one girl actually was making TikToks about I'm painting the cones, and this one here is where they basically found each other. We're like four or five videos away on the FYP, and it was spectacular. Uh, because it just kind of shows you how how universal things are. If I can find it, let's oh here it is. I'm gonna play the clip and then we'll commentate on it. Uh, Chrome tab. It's so fascinating how the FYP can figure that stuff out by people's actions, by hashtags, by a million different factors. Oh yeah, and it's probably also the geographic location too. But I don't think this is anywhere near me. But I think once it goes mega viral, location doesn't matter. Day yeah, three of the traffic cone and painting. The cone. <laughs> What's that, Mark? Can you guys hear that? Yeah. Yes. All right. <laughs> so we show up to what? work this morning, and someone painted one of our cones like Patrick. <laughs> I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. <laughs> so. Like literally at the same time, like, like they were, I mean, it wasn't, that wasn't four posts away, but it was close on the FYP, relatively speaking. But I mean, this is what happens when everybody has a camera in their pocket. Everybody wants to go shoot and make stuff and go viral. Yeah. And then TikTok yeah. somehow finds it, brings it together. It could be people like one person saw this and they somehow crossed the other one. And then they are like, oh my God, I went back to the save uh, video and then like started tagging people. And then I guess the mass tag of the same person might be another factor. indicator no that they're idea. linked. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if you haven't, I mean, yeah, it's, and it's the stupidest stuff that goes viral. Like this girl just like randomly goes, I'm going to paint a traffic cone. Yep. And now wait, let's, let's see. She's got what? Four, I think four videos up. I'm not going to vote. That's all she has, right? Three. She's got three videos. Hold on. Let me, let me add this back on here. Here's her, here's her thing. Three videos. Wow. Yeah. And one was taken million- down. Because she had three. another one. Oh, she did. Yeah, so, there was there was four videos there yesterday. So next wow. you're going to see her on Good Morning America and on TikTok telling people how to go viral and so on. Yeah, mm-hmm. I, I mean, just paint traffic cones. I mean, that's that's 100% creating a story and everyone gets involved. And you know what's going to happen? She'll probably paint a fourth one, you think, maybe? Oh, yeah. This is a thing now. This is a thing. <laughs> She's oh, going yeah. around randomly painting traffic cones. Yeah, and then telling people to find her traffic. Yes, Yes, if you almost tag them and brand them, and then somebody will make an NFT. Someone will take a picture of it and then tokenize it. It'll be like oh, one wait. of those geocaches. <laughs> yeah, yeah. People, people want to see other things that she's painting, too. It turns into a, almost more of a storyline, right, that people can just watch kind of like on like Chilling every show. couple of days. Yeah, every couple of days you get to see, okay, what did she paint the next traffic cone like, right? And then, and then the person – the person whose traffic cone it is, are they going to get on TikTok or are they going to film it? You yeah. know? So it's like a, it just, people like to follow random story, random stories. That's pretty much all it comes down to because she got 150,000 followers and all she does is paint traffic cones.